I've been doing microgreens for about a month and a half now, and uh, I've been enjoying learning about how to grow my own micro farm with microgreens. And um, my first crop plan was this one, these uh, somewhat difficult to read notes. And um, I did that kind of based on how much production I wanted. And um, I, I found a problem or I found something that I can improve on that. Um, I put together this graphic of when things were going to be seeded and harvested. I'm uh, speaking on Friday, January 12. Um, and so the, the left columns are radish brassicas in the middle, green, sunflowers are yellow. And uh, so you can see that, uh, for example, here I was planning to seed on Sunday and harvest on Saturday. And, uh, you know, every, every one of these, but you'll notice that uh, the harvest times are not coordinated. They're not on the same time. And uh, what I've uh, moved toward is I want to make a mix of sunflower, uh, red cabbage, and radish, and I want the, the harvest to come at the same time. So I switch to a weekly schedule, and once again, I'm speaking on this day. So uh, I've changed everything here. Um, here are the radish, there are three columns now, here are the brassicas, and here are the suns. And essentially what I have been working on these days are weekly events. So radishes Wednesday and Saturday, once again Wednesday, and I've stopped here because I won't probably won't be planning in February, hopefully I'll be traveling. And then uh, brassicas Sunday and Wednesday. And then sunflowers Monday and Friday. So um, that's kind of a graphic of, and now my harvest line up. Oh, I do see something. That's probably before one that I started before uh, today. Anyway, down here, the harvests do line up. And I will have one tray of each. And I will mix them, and I'm going to um, put them together into five separate serving bins, uh, tubs. So I put uh, put together this plan, uh, crop plan, and radish. I'm going to do well before uh, Tuesday and Friday harvest. This is all based on Tuesday and Friday. I decided on those. I'm trying to copy some of the commercial growers, even though I'm only growing for myself at the moment. I do want to grow in a way that translates to commercial growing if I decide to do that. So five servings, I think they're going to be about 160 grams each, and uh, uh, that will uh, pr be produced twice a week. So there will be one three-day gap and one four-day gap. Radish, so Wednesday and Saturday, um, and here are the rules, 25 grams in a 1020 tray, top water 300, sub water 700, I probably could do sub water 1000 gram, uh, milliliters, that would probably work too, and then I will unstack on day four, and I will sub water 700, and I think that that's the last time I'll have to water it, I'll have to watch it, but um, I have had problems with watering too much for radish and the radish get very wet and I want to avoid that. I want to give them enough water but uh, on the harvest day I want them to be kind of dry on the dry side anyway. Brassicas are similar. Brassicas Wednesday and Sunday are the sow dates. Tw once again 25 grams. And here I'm using more water, top 300, sub 1,000. And on day five, I'm going to add sub 700 uh, milliliters of water. <clears throat> sub means from underneath. Bottom watering is called sometimes. And on day 10, I will harvest and I expect 150 grams. And once again, I don't think I will have to water twice. And I don't think that this will be too saturated 
uh, during germination and initial growth. So we'll see. That's kind of an experiment, but I have done it before. Sunflower, Mondays and Fridays, 250 grams, sanitize 15 minutes with 1 to 10 bleach water. Rinse directly into a 1020 tray without soaking overnight. Um, I'm going to try this. Um, I've tried it, but I haven't unstacked them yet. Um, and um, we'll see. And then uh, water top 300 and sub 1000. Day 5, sub 700. Um, that's actually daily. I'm going to have to add daily in here. Um, sunflowers use a lot of water and uh, every day from day 5 to day 11 at least, I will be adding 700 milliliters. And you can expect 530 grams on day 12 for a harvest. So that's my current crop plan. Um, having fun with this, uh, I have to say the quality of food from microgreens is excellent. And um, I'm really kind of excited because it's having the fun of planning out a garden, but you get to see the results within two weeks.